channel so for today's vlog I'm gonna make a little challenge for myself little challenge because um, I'm gonna make one of the famous Pakistani street food which um, I never tried making this before so this is my first time so this food is called um, Deibali or, or Deibara so um, since this is my first time, I'm gonna be needing my husband to coach me on the background so you're gonna hear his voice but he doesn't want to be in the camera so let's respect that and we'll just cook. So guys, if you want to learn how to make day ballet as well, so watch this video till end and let's learn together. So here are the ingredients that we need. Um, we're gonna need um, pakore. This pakore, I took only one cup and I um, soak it in the warm water. So it looks like that now. And we're gonna need um, day, day bundi. Okay, this is day bundi. I took also one cup and I soak it in the warm water. So we have to soak it for like 15 minutes. Also, we have the boiled uh, chana. We have two medium-sized boiled potato, which I sliced in these sizes. And one medium uh, onion. And I slice it thinly, so it would be nice to eat. And also, uh, one kilo of um, yogurt. So we have to blend the yogurt, but first we also need to add one-fourth sugar in it. So it would be a little sweet. And um, one teaspoon of salt. Also, we're gonna be needing this um, day butter mix. So we have to, this is how it is. So we're gonna add one cup of lukewarm water in it and make a batter and fry. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. And then after that, we're going to mix all the ingredients together to make our day butter. Okay, so this is our batter now. But this is going to be the bale and the food like the round thing that we eat which is nice so what my technique is I look for this kind of cup so, so I got this from the tang so this is a measuring cup of the tang so I'm gonna use this to make a round ballet when I fry it and also I'm gonna need an extra oil so this is just for dipping it there so that when we take just dip dip like that and when we take our butter we, it will, you know, it will slide off uh, smoothly on the oil. So now we're gonna start cooking. Okay, so first, what we do is... So we already dip our measuring cup in the oil. Then we scoop the butter like this and we drop it on the oil. So they will become brown. So scoop. See? Drop on the oil so it's big big ones it's okay it's not perfect but it's the thing we can do yes it's so we have to cook it for like until it become light brown so I have a whisperer <laughs> behind me <laughs> until light brown okay so just keep dropping and when your oil is finished if you notice that the butter is sticking on the scoop you have to you know dip it again in the oil and then just by the way it's a cooking oil okay just want to clarify it and then keep dropping it's okay if it's not perfect we are not really a professional chef <laughs> So keep dropping. The most important thing is that it tastes good. So you reverse it so that the other side will be cooked. Yes, it's ready now. We're gonna take it out from the oil and we're going... Sorry, that one fell down. I'm gonna pick it up later. We're gonna take it from the oil and we are going to soak it in the water for 15 minutes. Okay guys, so this is not our day now. We already blended them. We added the salt and the uh, sugar. So first we're gonna put just a small layer on the base of our um, serving bowl. 
And then we add this day movie. Day Spread it. Okay, next we have to add this pakori. Just spread it like that. Potatoes, the boiled ones. Just gonna add it. I wanted to add, honestly, you know, we're still boiling the um, chickpeas right now, so the ones that I have is still not ready. So I think I prefer not to add this because, you know, it will ruin our appetite later when it's still hard. So I suggest not to put this now. But guys, if you're planning to make day butter, so the night before, you have to already prepare for the channa because you have to boil it. It takes time to... to soften the chana so that's why I'm not gonna put that one then I'm gonna put um, balene I said I cannot put this chana because this is not ready so can you take it? oh okay spread like that okay yeah. okay and that's ready and we're going to add sprinkle our onions on the top So you have to cut the onions thinly because they're gonna be like a crisp. Okay, I think not really a lot. If you wanna add, I'm just gonna put this in the table. If you wanna add more onions, then you can just take from here, okay? And then we're gonna put... Okay, now we're gonna add our remaining day. Or, by the way, this is yogurt for those who don't understand day. Okay, we'll spread it. This is our first time, so don't expect it to be perfect. So yes, they have to be soaking in the day or in the yogurt. And then we're gonna put the chat masala. So this is chat masala. We already removed it from the packet. We're gonna sprinkle it like that. Ready. And by the way, I forgot to mention earlier that we need crispers. So this is the crispers that is available here in Pakistan. Uh, Bale papri. Okay, so we're gonna put these crispers on the top so it would be nice and crispy when we eat them. I like it more crispy, Shabbat. But the shape of the bale starts The shape of the bale Okay guys, so this is our debale. Okay, for a first timer like me, this is how it is. So I hope you like this video and you're going to like and share and subscribe if you're new to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. So guys, this is our day ballet now. Um, I put it in a serving bowl. And um, anyway, I just want to mention, I just want to say that um, if you want to maintain the thickness of the yogurt, you can just, um, you know, add the sugar and the salt and just mix it with you know, some spoon manually. You don't need to blend it the same way as I did because if you do that way, then the, the yogurt becomes thin. It's not creamy. Or thick anymore so yeah you can do the manual way but if you want your yogurt to be a little bit thin the same as the one that I made then you can just do the way I did which I blended it so that's all guys I hope that you like this video and you're going to like and share it and subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Facebook thank you so much everyone